and terrorism has taken over our farms. When farmers can't go to farm anymore, farmers, farmers are now paying bandits and terrorists money to go to farm to farm, which is a very, very sad situation. To, to, to now cap it all, instead of the president to bring out all his security men and send them to the north to go and tackle this terrorism and this banditry, the president is now signing into law GMOs, genetic modified organism. Genetic modified organism, even the white people that created it, that initiated it with their innovation, they are running away from it because it's causing cancer, it's killing their citizens. So now you bring it to Nigeria to come and kill Nigerians. Nigerians who are just hustling to make their money, no electricity, no water, no, uh, no proper infrastructure, no good roads, nothing. They are just struggling their life. They've been pushed to the wall. They are just trying to survive. Now you want to add to their problem. Where are they going to get money to go to hospital to go and treat cancer? You and I know what gen genetic modified organism is. For dad and mom, papa and mama, we no understand what they try to talk for village. If not the good market, make una be very careful. Make una make sure say na farm product, organic product una buy. Because the product where Mr. President signed for market now, say make that they produce, even down with it, go follow them, produce them. It go kill people, it go cause cancer. People will die. You go look for money to go to hospital. You go see the product. It go long. You yam we supposed to be like this. Yam go long. It go big. You to say na wolf. No be a wolf. Na cancer you won't chop so. So please, Nigerians, be careful of that. So for me, you know, the president has made a lot of wrong move. Which whether he like it or not, you know, some people have to tell him. You understand what I'm saying? So many many things like that, my brother.